Mom, I'm fucking drunk! <laughs> Hello friends, my name is Brandon Dayton, I am your humble narrator, and welcome to my Dayton Dissects of Grow Home. It is a very casual platforming game, we will say. So there are a lot of cool features in this game, and uh, a lot of treats to help you get around in the environment. This is the star plant, which I am growing up to the sky. You need to plug it into those glowy rocks. You can see one way over there. And that will help it sprout new uh, new pieces so it can sprout even further. Go this way. Woo! Let's see what these islands hold. Over, over yonder. There are mana crystals to collect. Every time you collect a certain amount of mana crystals, I believe it's 20, you'll unlock a new power. It might be 10. But it is really fun. I can tell you the first power you will unlock is a, a zoom out feature like this. Normally you're right behind Bud's head, but this feature allows you to get a bit more of a an in-depth view. Wow. <laughs> Absolutely crazy. Do some free falling. Oh snap! Let's see if I can catch a catch a thing without hitting it. Oh god! Oh fart! All right, catch it! Catch it! Oh, we landed on a leaf. That worked out well. And there's a teleporter over there. So let's see if I can go hit that teleporter. The controls are pretty cool. Your left stick controls Bud's head. The right stick controls the camera, which is basically where Bud is looking. Uh, or where where your hands will be placed more accurately. I do need another flower. So I grab one like this and pluck it like so. And don't fall off. <laughs> And on your way up, you'll unlock teleporters so you can easily navigate the island. I'm going to go back up. You don't want to hold your flower open for too long, ladies, <laughs> because it decays relatively quickly. Uh, it's best to use to catch yourself when you get like to an uncontrollable speed. And then from there, you can kind of skydive into... Uh, whatever you'd like to cling on to. Alright. Where's that rock? Is it way up there? It is way up there. Well, I'm gonna get some assistance from this. Grab the tip. You gotta grab the tip, ladies. <laughs> Whee! Soaring high into the wild blue yonder. Up. Up. Did we pass it already? Not yet. Oh, shite. Shite! You need to have control of your phallus. Boosh. So plugging that in will make the main plant grow. Which is already towering way above what I'm currently doing. But I think that is the point. Oh, shit! Look, that is a secondary island. The actual island is way, way, way down there. Awesome. I only have two petals left. I'm gonna try and land on that thing, now. And if I miss it... It's gonna be bad. It's gonna be real bad. Shite! Oh my god, it's terrible! Okay. Alright, everything's fine. Everything's fine. It's not fine. I missed everything. Oh, snap! Uh, yay! Let's go! Grow it up, grow it up. This is the lazy man's way of traveling. I could jump from leaf to leaf and whatnot. But it's so much funner to just steer this giant thing and know that it'll be there forever. 
possibly blocking my path as I leap on leaves. All right. Let's see if I can go. Okay. All right. All right. All right. Come on. Yes. No. No. It's fucking over. Oh my god. Unless I catch this thing, it's so over. Nope. Done. Oh. You can jump and climb. Fall down cliffs. Oh, fart. Oh no. Bud cannot go in the water. He can go in the water, but not over his head. It can go over his head, but not for too long. Or he'll fall apart. And then his mom says he does a good job. For some reason. Okay, we're going this way now. I don't think I'm going to make it back over there. Altitude loss critical! We're never going to make it back over there. Nope. They did this on purpose. Alright. We need some so we don't die as soon as we hit the ground. Eee. Okay. Oh my god! Good job, bud! He didn't even touch the water. Atta boy. Atta boy. Now we're back on dry land. <laughs> so to speak. Uh oh. No, not the water! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> this is too much fun. Whoa! 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 <laughs> this game does have a day and night cycle too. So you can kind of see the spots that you're looking for a little better during the night. Because they glow like so. So let's go. Back fro. Oh wait, back to. But that wouldn't rhyme. Oh well, I don't have time. Gotta climb the plant. For my aunt. She bought me this game. That's not true. Into the blue! Woo! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, there's a mana crystal hidden under the bouncy things. Come here, you. I need this. Oh, I didn't grab it. A few more crystals and I get a new power. Which is really great for keeping you motivated to play the game. Because it is a bit repetitive. You're growing a plant. Um, but the goals are nice. It's it's basically casual as it comes, but for some reason I'm I enjoy it more than most casual games. Cuz you can do shit like that. It's like cliffhanger. Jean-Claude Van Damme, you know what I'm talking about? Doesn't matter. It's like that, but with Jean-Claude Van Damme instead of a robot and you know, explosives instead of plants. I'm so jealous that kids get games like this. I mean, we had our share of good games in the day, but nothing like this. It's just gorgeous, and it's fun as hell. You get to grow your own. It's like Chia Pet, if Chia Pet was any good. That's what it is. <laughs> is that a teleporter? Oh, hell yes. Hell yes, new, new teleporter, hell yes. All right. So, first you do the Jean-Claude Van Damme cliffhanger thing, and then you pick a daisy. <laughs> we are going into space. You can see the the ozone layer, basically. This is so crazy. Ah! I got, like, that feeling in the pit of my stomach, just looking down there. And this one looks a little harder to plug into, just because it's covered in things. Yeah. Oh, we got it. We did, we did. Wow, it's reached the stratosphere. It must be close to blooming. Oh, 
broke that rocket. Boom! Okay, am I stuck in a thing now? Oh my god, I was about to be devastated. Absolutely devastated. Alright. So should we should we keep going I guess? I there's a space station up there. Jesus. This game goes on forever. Oh, okay. Stop self. You can do it, you can do it. You need some help. But you can totally do it. <laughs> Just because you got some help doesn't mean you didn't do it, bud. It's just a stupid flower. It's not going to tell anybody, okay? I swear he talks to me. He knows what I'm saying into the microphone right now. The Mikey phone. Okay. And, uh, now where are we going to go? How about over there? Zhoosh. Here you go. Plug it in. Plug it in there. That's good. Uh, uh, sweet. There it is. Now go get that star seed. Oh yes, climb the asteroid, bud. You're such a little badass. It is moving. Oh my god, that's so cool. Okay. Climb. Climb. Climb, climb, climb. Shit! Flower! <laughs> There's a crystal. I need it. Gimme, 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 gimme. Gimme, gimme, gimme. We have enough power for minimal thrust. Oh, fantastic. Oh, super cool powers. What? I was so disappointed with the zoom that I didn't go for the crystals very much. But you get a jetpack? Wow. That is a reason for completion, to be sure. See you in hell! <laughs> Oh my god, we're doing a thing. Don't hit that rock. It's very dangerous. Oh, oh god. Oh lord. Oh no. <laughs> Alright. Okay. No, it's good. It's fine. It's <laughs> such free fall. And this is the art that I've created on the way up. My poop art. There's a teleporter. Breaks! 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 Mom, I got a thing! There's a teleporter on that ship. I want. Does it not sprout near the top? I don't understand. There's only leaves up here. I guess it's something scientific, you know, it's like the plant can't breathe because there's no oxygen in space and we already reached the stratosphere, so like, don't fall, goddammit! <laughs> <laughs> Set science aside for a minute, the survival instinct kicks in. Oh yeah, alright. Up, up, up. Gotta do it. Gotta do it. To the spaceship! Don't crash into the spaceship. Just what if we can drive it? I wanna drive it. I wanna drive it! Ah! <laughs> nice park job! Alright. I'll climb my spaceship. <laughs> oh, we're home. Where? It's gotta be inside the ship, but how do I get in? <laughs> Someone unlock the door! <laughs> Please! It's very cold out here in the stratosphere! 
I locked my keys inside. <laughs> okay, we good? We fucking established that I've unlocked this now. Well, let's go see mom. Mom, I'm home! Your little baby boy is bouncing down the hall. What? You're just a computer. What is this madness? I'll destroy you! <laughs> Mission update. This star seed is incredible. We need more. About eight more. Except mission? No! <laughs> My name is Bud! So I think this game is absolutely incredible. I'm okay with the music dropping in and out because it's really used to emphasize the point. Um, usually that's something that I would discourage, but it's it's used pretty well here because I, there's something about nature games uh, not having music that I'm completely okay with. I can't finish this review by the time I hit the ground, but maybe I can f finish the cons because that's basically about it. Uh, it does lack a little replayability, just because you just grow a plant to the spaceship. But it, overall, we're done, we're done, we're done! <laughs> Pros, this game, uh, e extremely fun. Uh, you know what you're getting into, and it's extremely pretty to look at. Completionists will enjoy scouring for mana crystals. I can see two up in that mountain, and, uh, I should go get some more because I want to figure out what else I can get besides this boost which is already pretty decently awesome it probably gets even better soundtrack's pretty good it's it's a weird animation kind of style uh, however I find that it works just fine it creates a pretty cartoony aesthetic which is kind of necessary for having you plummet through the world and still feel good about it like in Just Cause, plummeting and stuff is a lot more intense. And to increase the replayability, they do have uh, skins and such that you can unlock, probably on multiple playthroughs or by doing something special, which I haven't figured out yet, so I just have Bud. But I love Bud. He's such a badass, once again. I definitely did enjoy this game. I will give it a 72 out of 100, just because it does lack a little depth. Uh, and replayability. But other than that, wonderful game by Reflections. <clears throat> and I hope you guys will check it out for yourself because it, because it is only $8 on Steam. So, friends, once again, this has been Grow Home. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. I hope you'll join us for the next time. Until then, bye bye! One, two, three. Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friends.